It's 4108 West 19th place. You got a fenced in yard. I want to show you the yard, but I don't, I have, this is a big house. <laughs> it's a lot of rooms. So this is a four bedroom, one bathroom, slab home. It's big. This is your recreational room. It could be a TV room for your kids. It could be uh, a game room, an office. This is seven by 18. Separate yet together. Flows right into the open living space, okay? I do, I'm doing this video over, re-listing it to show you the new stuff. Okay, so here's your kitchen area, open concept. Looks nice. Look at the backsplash. Bada bang, bada bing. You know what? I forgot to turn this on. Just so you know it works, okay? Stove goes there, fridge goes here, you have space for a double wide. You turn around and here's your open space, TV up top, down there you put your TV, uh, your pictures, your remotes, all the things that, that, that you need handy and you always lose, put them right there, boom. You walk this way and, and, and uh, this is your closet. I'm closing this door for a reason. This is gonna be the grand finale. So this is just all year round closet space. You got two doors for it, but a bang, but a bing. You got LVP, nice paint. This is your utility. This is for extra storage, linens and things, toilet paper, a lot of shelving. Okay, well, let's start with the smallest room. This is a nine by 11 bedroom. Is the smallest room. There's your closet, nine by 11. Good size room, okay? This is gonna be bedroom number two. This is gonna be a 12 by 12. It's a nice square, we'll get this out of here. Those guys left it, I just sent them a picture of it. 12 by 12, nice. The last time I tried to do this video was all gloomy and Plus we added some stuff, so that adds to it. Oh, uh, let's do the let's do this one. This is your bathroom. Fans on, lights on, tile surround, matches the backsplash in the front. Very good, very good, very nice. Very good, very good, very nice. Walk this way. This is your third bedroom. Remember, there's four. Four bedrooms. One bath. This is probably a 12 by 13 or 14. Got a nice size closet. So it's a 12 by 13. I will focus on the headboard here. Bed, you can put any size bed in this one. Okay, let's go back. This is bedroom three. And this is bedroom two. You can sit in any size bed in here too. This is bedroom one. With a bang with me. And then, the grand finale, your walk-in bedroom number four. Bam. So you walk in to your own storage. You put the washer and dryer in your room. Here's for extra hanging for him. Here's your laundry hookups, but a bang, but a bean. But ideally, if you want to be kind to let the other kids in to wash their clothes, Here's a, another door into the actual room room. And here's another closet. See that? Same LVP running. And here's your master. Ha <laughs> ha. Look at this. It's like a living room, right? Bada bang. Bada bing. Yes, sir. So, this room is probably what? 12 by 20? You can fit anything. You can fit two beds, three beds. If you needed a master bedroom that was not as big as this, but you have twins or two kids that could share, you could fit them both in here with two beds. They don't have to have bunk beds. Just half and half rooms, you know? So just to show you this, Easier way to bring in the furniture for this back master room. Assuming you're gonna have a big room. You do have a fenced in yard. Bada bang, bada bing. I want to show you that. Uh, so, 
This is huge. Four bed, one bath, slab is heating. 